for joining us today. We're right in the middle of our holiday. The sun is shining and it is a beautiful day. Let me pray for you. Dear God, thank you for bringing us here today. Let us learn more about who you are. And everyone said, Amen. Amen. It's so hot that it's time for us to go and get a suntan. While we do that, here's worship.
too much, son. HSK, there's so many things that could change around in the world that we can feel different about. But there's one person who will always stay the same. And that's God. God loves you so much. He loves me so much. And you know what? He will never change no matter what. In Exodus 32 verse 1, it says, the people saw that a long time had passed and Moses had not come down from the mountain. So they gathered around Aaron. They said to him, Moses led us out of Egypt, but we don't know what's happened. So make us gods who will lead us. And you see, what's really going on here is the people of Israel are scared. They don't feel protected. They think that Moses is the one protecting them, but it's actually God who's protecting them. And they just don't understand that God is everywhere. He's with you all the time. And you see, hey, just Kate, I want you to remember this one thing, that it is God who protects us. God is for you. He loves you so much. And he's never going to give you anything that you cannot handle. There's two quick points that I want you to remember today. Number one, put God at the center of your heart. We are designed by God to be with God. We're not meant to do life alone. God wants to help you with everything that you do, whether it is when you go to school or when you do your homework or when you speak to your friends or when you're feeling a little happy or a bit sad. And number two is we need to think about God first. And what I mean by that, HSK, is when we wake up in the morning, let's be like, God, what do you need from me today? What can I do for you today, God? What, what, what is going to be best for me today, God? Because God has all wisdom. He has all understanding. And he wants to give that to you. All you need to do is ask God to be there with you. You see, HSK, you can definitely have too much sun, but you can never have too much God. Come on, Jordan. Come on right now. You guys go on without me. I'm just enjoying the heat. Come on, Jordan, it's, uh, it's your turn to speak. Mims, I've planned my tan to precision. I know exactly how to get the perfect tan. You guys just go on without me. Well, what are we supposed to do? You guys have got this. Um, really sorry. Um, John's just busy sunbathing. But while he's doing that, why don't we put God first and join him in the big word dance video? Mims, I'm just gonna need you to put some sun lotion on my back, please. Oh, I love the sun. Jordan, are you still sunbathing? Yeah, Mims, I have found the perfect spot. I have sun all day. You know, we're not here to sunbathe. But Nicole, we're halfway through our holiday and I can't be going back looking all pasty. Trust me, I need this sun. Jordan, I think you've lost your focus. We're not here for the sun. We're here to help the kids learn about God. Yeah, but we could do that later. No, we can't. The kids are here now. They're watching us now. And right now, they're watching you, Sunbabe. And that really isn't that interesting. And when was the last time you had a drink of water? You're right, I am feeling a little bit thirsty. And when was the last time you put on suntan lotion? It's not good for you, you know, all this sun. You are right, I do feel very warm. Come on, Jordan. It's time to focus and put God first. You guys are right. I'm sorry I got distracted, but I'm focused now. I'm here and I'm sorry to you too. I'll fix it. Why don't we check out Let's Get Crafty? Hey, 
HSK, it's that time of year that when we step outside we get to see the beautiful flowers growing everywhere, maybe in the park or in your garden. And I love flowers, all flowers of every colour. But one of my favourite flowers is the sunflower. And did you know that as it grows and stands tall, that it actually follows the sun? So the sunflower head looks up and it follows the sun as the sun travels across the sky. How cool is that? And so today we are gonna paint our own sunflower art. So are you ready? Let's go. So the only thing we're gonna draw for our sunflower is the center. It's a circle, which is the center of the flower. And we're gonna paint that dark brown, okay? So get your paints at the ready. We're gonna need brown going to need white and yellow, okay? So, we're just going to paint the circle, the centre of our flower. And then once we've done that, we're going to need two cotton buds. And what we're going to do with the cotton buds is we're going to use, we're going to dip it in the white paint. And these are going to create our dot around the center of the sunflower. So get your yellow paint. And then the petals, they're gonna be um, like leaves, okay? So we're just gonna paint them down like that. And then we paint the next one. And the petals, they kind of join together. Can you see how they meet each other at the sides? And I'm just going to paint it all the way around the dark circle that we've just painted. Once we've got our initial petals, now you can either use the same yellow and make and paint other petals in between the gaps here, or we can go a bit darker. And what I'm gonna do is just add a little bit of brown to some of the yellow, just to make it a little bit darker, and add some white. Okay, and then I'm gonna do the same just here, look and then just paint in between. It might take some time, that's, that's okay. Just enjoy painting. Okay, and then what we're gonna do with that same darker color, we're just gonna do some shading in the lighter petals. So what we're gonna do is kind of flick the brush, like so. And it just gives a bit more detail in the petals. Okay, and then when that's dry, we can go over the center again. We can use the um, cotton buds and go around the center, and then we're gonna paint our background. Once you've finished painting your sunflower, now for the finishing touches, and with our cotton bud, we're going to go around the edge of the circle with splodges, can you see? And it makes it look more realistic, the centre of the sunflower. And then just use a light colour for the centre. And if you don't like what you've done, just go over it. Done. 
and all your paint is dry, find a corner and sign your work and put the date on it because you never know this could be worth a lot of money in years to come and there you go there's our sunflower art and guys it's okay if you don't like it the first time you do it or maybe it doesn't even look like a sunflower it took me 10 tries to paint a sunflower that i actually liked you just have to keep practicing and don't give up and when you've done it ask an adult to tag in your artwork into our hillsong kids instagram and then we'll get to see the amazing art that you have made have lots of fun how are you feeling jordan much better i'm sorry guys i was so focused on the sun that i'd forgotten about talking to god oh we're glad to have you back with us jordan would you like to pray i'd love to god we thank you for who you are we thank you that we can talk to you about anything we pray that we have the best week ever in your mighty name everyone said amen, amen. we'll see you next week bye Hey parents, if you want to get connected and make friends in your local area, then we would love to help you. Head to the Hillsong Kids website, click connect me, fill out the form, then we'll give you a call because we want you to be in community. We don't want you to be parents alone. Also, we've got kids Zooms happening every Sunday. So if you want your kids to be engaged, then you can do that. Also, we filmed a parenting course called Power to the Parents Live. So you can also head to the website to watch all the recordings from all the previous weeks. Enjoy. Hi guys, don't forget to check out our HSK app for more activities and daily devotionals. And you can get your grown up to check out our website to find out how to get connected.